So welcome to this brief video introducing you to the Viasoft Rental Software. The Viasoft Rental Software is an online based program which you can access from PC, Mac and iPad as long as you are connected to the internet. The first thing you will see when you enter the program is the dashboard. In the left column on the dashboard you will see all the upcoming orders and it's very easy to go select an order and get out a copy of the confirmation. In the middle column you have all the tasks. It could be assigned to users and given different priorities. In the right column you will have in the bottoms some news where you can easily post new news for your business. It could be new employees, projects, etc. You have some reports saying how your business is performing right now and you have the available products. It's very easy to go select the date, category, see what do we have available and what do we have booked on the selected date. On the dashboard you will also find a coverage report showing in graphic how are we booked and on the dashboard we will also have the big overview showing you what's going out and what's coming back home. There's a lot of different functionalities in the program and a lot of settings. If we start with the settings, it's easy to access support from the Microsoft help desk. We have some factor settings saying we will multiply the price with 1.5 or 2, whatever you like, if the customer rents for two days. And this goes on and on and on. Then you have departments if you have several offices in your business. We have some basic settings, it's your company address, logo, etc. Order types, you can have different layouts for your orders, fields, etc. You have a graphical editor to edit the design on your confirmation and your invoices. It's very easy, it's drag and drop to go and, and edit fields. Then we have users. You have three levels of users. You have administrators, super users and users. The administrator have total access. The super users can see all the orders and create new orders. And the users can only see orders where the users have been assigned as crew. You can add user groups. It could be instructor, technicians, etc. You can set up different conditions, saying condition A, B, C, depending on which type of order you get. It's what we call page 2, and see all the legal stuff. Then we have a lot of uh, email templates, you can create new ones. This template is hello customer name. We have received your order, and we'll get back to you. So it's easy to go select a customer and send an email template and this means that here we will put in the customer's name. You have some payment methods. It's online payment, invoice, whatever you like for your business. And we have the news. It's the news I showed you on the front page. Modules is add-on modules. It's like SMS messages for your customers before and after rental starts and ends. It's shell due to emails. It could be an email to your customer, sending out an email template to all customers. Could be two days before delivery date. Then we could send an email template saying, hey, we are looking forward to delivering your order. And then we have a file archive where you can add files to orders. Then we also have an add-on module called Shop. It's to control a web shop where your customer can online book free units. In reports, you will get a lot of different statistics out. It could be order statistics, how our business is performing right now compared to last year, last month, etc. Revenue reports. Revenue reports. 
it could be which customer have bought which products it could be if you want to see all customer who have bought a party tent it will list all the customers who have bought this product uh, and you can make some excel reports export customers etc then you have the products we have four types of products in our system we have rental products which are products you rent out we have sales products when you add one to an order one is removed from the warehouse we have virtual products virtual products is like work hours uh, freight etc and and package products it's a product consisting of other products we also have a project management tool where you can add project and add tasks to the different projects and you can also add time records to keep track on yeah ongoing projects we have the planning where you can go and make for instance a new trip for one of your drivers say new trip and you can decide this trip contains orders which is supposed to be delivered in this period will be delivered with this truck at this capacity this will be the driver and there's a start and end address so it's actually very easy to to go and add your orders say I want to deliver in this this order save your route and you can click and you get out a total a total report with all the orders for the driver and a copy of all of the packaging notes then we have the then we have the crew planning where you can go and add crew to your different orders just say I want to add Richard to this order what happens is that Richard get an email say hey Richard you have been added as a crew to this order will you accept this job and you can click yes and no and you will get a notice saying hey Richard have accepted or hey Richard have not accepted this order you can also go and say hey I want a work schedule for this employee will get a PDF with all the bookings for this guy and along will be a copy of all the bookings then you have your customer database in your customer database you can go you have all the basic stuff on your customers delivery information you can add some notes you can see the previous orders on this customers and for instance make a copy of previous orders or you can see all emails sent to this customer by clicking this button then we have all your orders all your bookings so you can see all all upcoming bookings we have them here this icon with one green man means the internal note is the packaging list. Then you have the one with a green and a blue guy is the customer confirmation. You can see there's room for signature, etc. And you can easily go and add fields yourself. Then you have the copy booking button and send customer an email. You can just go, say I want to send this template to the customer, send email, and an email will be sent to the customer. You also have the option to transform the booking into an invoice. It will be assigned an invoice number, save invoice, and an invoice will be created based on the booking. If we have a look at the booking window, you can see you select a customer 
a date. You can say what conditions does this booking follow? How is the customer supposed to pay? Status, is it a quote or is it booked? And you can add some different informations. You can easily go and create new fields here. Add edit fields. Product lines. Could be he wants a tent. It comes up with all the available tents. You add it to the product lines and it will be reserved in the warehouse. You can say I want to uh, add a deposit of 200 pounds here. You can say save an email or you can just say save. And press here to sort it. If you go then and have a look at the booking, just say here. You can see that the tent have been added to the order and line with deposits. You can see some of the other options. You have delivery information saying delivery address or is it uh, or will the customer pick up himself. You have the crew planning where you can go and add crew to the order. We have the crew planning where you can add crew to the order. And we have the files where you can put internal and external files to the order. It could be pictures, descriptions, etc. which will follow the order and it will be merged in along with the confirmation. Let's go back here and say save an email. Just select the template and the template along with the confirmation in PDF will be sent to the customer. We also have the search function up here, it could be the Charles call us. Go and see all the details on Charles. So this is a very short introduction on how the Microsoft Rental software is working. If you have any questions, feel free to text us, call us, we'll be glad to help you.